All right, the next phrase is depending on the quality in January. Depending on the quality in January. Depending, depending. Depending, um, the, the stress is on the middle syllable, depending, depending. So that DE in the front, you're going to say it either D or D or D. It's not going to matter that much because it's going to be so fast. Depending, depending. And it's usually an an I on the depending. Some people might say depending, depending, I or a, depending on the quality in January. January, January, January. So that AR before the Y at the end there, pretend it's spelled like A I R. So it's an air sound, not an R. Don't say January, it's uh, January. Depending on the quality in January, we might move forward. We might have more sales. Depending on the quality in January. The next phrase is schedule of events. Schedule. That CH is like a K or a C sound. So K, ske, ske, schedule, jul, jul. That DU is more like a JU, j, jewel, jewel. When there's an L, um, jewel, jewel. Your lips are going to kind of round as if there were a W in there. Schedule, 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 schedule. Because the UL, you're going to go OO for you. OO, see your lips round. And then your tongue is going to come up and touch your teeth for the L. Schedule, 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 schedule. Um, I know in other English speaking countries, they might say schedule. Sorry, I know it just sounds so weird to us. Um, yeah, they might say schedule. So, which is fine. There's really no reason why that can't be a thing, right? Um, I can think of a... I can think that I have someone here early, so I will have to pause and finish this later. Okay, moving on, we have the word design. Design. The S in the middle is a Z sound, design. Do you have the latest design? I like your design. Design. Uh, my cat, okay. Motion, motion. Let's put that plan in motion. The T-I-O-N, that's like an, an S-H. U-N, shun, shun, motion. Let's put that plan in motion. I second the motion. Motion. And then the next word is mission. Mission. Another SH sound in the middle there, even though it's spelled with an SS, but we still have that. Um, well, it's spelled a little differently, but we have S I O N. Mission. Mission. Um, do we have a mission statement yet? What is our mission statement going to be? Mission. 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 Uh, mission. Profile, profile. What is your profile picture like? I need a profile picture from you right away. Or um, I don't see that on your profile. Can you put that on your profile? Profile, profile, profile. I and then L. Just touch your tongue to the back of your teeth. Profile, profile. Next word, parameters, parameters. Syllable stress is on the second one, parameters. And so meters, not meters. We wouldn't say parameters. It's one of those where we just kind of go meters, meters, parameters, parameters, iters or utters, parameters, parameters, parameters. It's a non-stress syllable, so parameters, 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 parameters. Let's keep it within the following parameters. Let's keep it within the following parameters for this job. Parameters. Okay, responsible. Responsible. Responsible is how we usually pronounce it in casual conversation. Responsible. You could probably get away with that. Responsible. The accent is on the second syllable. Responsible. Who is going to be responsible for that? Am I responsible for that? Um, 
I'm a very responsible person. Responsible. Sible. Sible. That's really quick. And the L at the end, just a quick touching of the tongue to the upper teeth. Responsible. And that is an S um, there in the third syllable. And the first. Responsible. Next word is exit criteria. Exit. E as in red. I as in silver. Exit. Exit criteria. Cry. I as in white. Teria. Long E. Teary on both of those. Eria. Exit criteria. Um, make sure you have the proper exit criteria. Exit criteria. Exit. Exit. Um, the X in that particular word, it's not a KS sound. It's not exit. Exit. We don't usually say it with a KS. Um, exit. We usually say it with more of a GZ. Exit. Exit. I don't know why. I just know we do. I know there are some X's that we pronounce with a KS, and it's usually at the end of the word. For instance, fax. Send me a fax. That's KS. That X is KS sounding. Fax. Um, exit. Exam. Examine. Those are all GZ. Eggs. Eggs. Exit. Exit criteria.